Hello, friends. It's us, Seant, and... Ah, yes, I am uploading on a weird day. I'm uploading on a Saturday. And this is not the game that I was last playing. This is Residence. Why am I doing Residence? Well, it's on sale, and it's a point-and-click adventure, and I like point-and-click adventures. I'm not going to go through all of it. May Or, I mean, it may turn into a Let's Play, but right now I'm just going to give you guys a sneak peek, because, uh... It's on sale on Steam, so I thought, you know, you want to have a little look-see before they buy. With that in mind, let's begin. Unconfirmed reports now coming in from Zurich, bringing the total number of countries experiencing attacks over the last hour up to 12. And we are still waiting for word from our Washington Bureau since losing contact with them approximately 20 minutes ago. Explosions or some type of attacks have occurred in cities around the globe. The attacks are accompanied by power surges, large-scale blackouts. At this time, we do not know the exact nature of these attacks, but they do not appear to be conventional explosives. Some have pointed out, and this is still just speculation, these attacks appear to resemble the incident that took place at the Juno Particle Accelerator in Aventine City on Sunday morning, though authorities have been calling that an accident. What connection the incident in Aventine City could have had uh, to these worldwide attacks is, at this point, unknown. Uh, being told now, we've established... Ooh. That sound. Make it stop. Where is that noise coming from? So we got inventory over here. I don't know what that is, but uh, hopefully it's not important. It said, look in the drawers. Ah. Let's look in those drawers. Still don't know what this does. It's got some voice acting, that's cool. Ooh, key! There's the key. I like the key. So let's see, I go to inventory, I use key. So now I click the drawers. Oh, drag it. So, drag key to drawers. Okay. So now I go to inventory and I drag battery to cell phone. Very simple. Hmm. 
Dr. Morales, did, uh, you just call me? Eddings? Ed. Yeah, it's me. Oh, good. Listen, I need your help with something. Now? It's like 6.30 in the morning. On a Sunday. Is it? I didn't wake you up, did I? Ignore the question. Don't worry about it. <laughs> what do you need my help with? Direct them to the point as usual, I see. First, I need you to confirm something. Did you finish those equations I gave you on Friday? Yeah, just last night, actually. Good. Do you have the results? Let's see, so I can drag... There. Cool. Got them right here. How close were our estimates? Spot on. There's definitely an inverse relationship between attraction and proximity. Dr. Morales, you still with me? I'm here. It's truly astonishing, and wait until you see my proof. You were right all along. This is a vindication of... I'm going to destroy them. Them? My research, the data, the results. I'm destroying it all. But resonance? It's your life's work. You can't just... I've been here all weekend thinking about it. This isn't a scientific or a mathematical dilemma. It's an ethical one. And trust me, I much prefer my problems to be hypothesized, tested, and quantified. You're wrong. It is math. Everything is. The potential for good far outweighs the possibility of misuse. You can't deprive the world of such... Danger? Someone's been following me, Eddings. I know it. Just please, don't destroy anything yet. I'll come in right now. I'm on my way. Wait for me. Weird. Six fifty five. The top left. Oh, we can choose things. That says seven oh five. This says six. Um, no, oh, that's a 7.30, this says 6, something. um, um, I don't know, uh, this one looks cool. Oh, a little girl. What? Done. Now you have the key to my treasure. Keep it safe, okay? Okay. One, six, five. Okay. Thank you, Senior Bear. Open the chest. It's upside down.
Five nine one. Got it. That's what I got. That's how I got mixed up. He's gonna break in. Para ti. Wow, it's like a million dollars. <laughs> not quite, and they're not dollars, they're pesos. I put one in this jar every day. I That's 300. It's not a lot, but if you save them, maybe. I'm not going anywhere, Anna Angel. Te prometo. What? Now you have the key to my treasure. Keep it safe, okay? Okay. Para ti, mi sobrina. Wow, it's like a million dollars. <laughs> not quite, and they're not dollars, they're pesos. I put one in this jar every day. I was that's three hundred. It's not a lot, but if you Uncle Harvey, don't go. I'm not. Te promet. Wonder. Go pesos, go pesos. Uh, okay. 
we can't go there anymore. Uh, we'll go go to the dashboard. Yeah. Yeah. Dawn in Aventine City. The sun's beams glide between the buildings like a man's strong fingers through a dame's hair. The sight made me realize just how long I've been out here. No. Some low-level cat burglar caught breaking into the computer chip factory uptown had named this post office as a contact point for his buyer. Normally I'd say this wasn't the kind of lead that warranted an all-night stakeout, but the chief's dogged insistence that I drop this case pretty much guaranteed I was going to follow it through. Why did she want me off this case so bad? Could the chief have some connection to this criminal organization? I had a lot of questions, and my gut was telling me exactly two things. One, that I was hungry. And two, that it was Reggie's turn to go get some donuts. Uh, no. I got us those sandwiches a couple hours ago, remember? Yeah, but you didn't get the donuts. <gasps> That's brilliant! Oh, wow. So, how did you get the chief to sign off on this stakeout? Oh, right. About that. If anyone asks, we were patrolling the neighborhood around the arson all night. I'm not gonna get reprimanded for this, am I? Relax, Reg. Sir! Here. What are you doing? That guy came from the alley. We don't have visibility down there. Which means, when he leaves, we're gonna lose him. I've got to get us a better line of sight. How are you gonna do that without them seeing you? I don't know. I'll grow some eyes in the back of my head. This is against regulations. You're out of the military now, Reg. This is police work. Sometimes you gotta pick which orders you're gonna follow. And other times, you gotta make your own orders. Detective Bennett. Going radio silent. Be careful. I see. Well. Excellent. So, what I was talking about before is that that is the same guy who does the voiceover in Bastion. He never seen. does the whole he does the whole game <laughs> I thought I fixed my GV, but I don't think it's gonna work here.
think I'm missing something. Yeah. <laughs> I think someone already did. Stupid. You can use the car mirror to look around corners. Aha, see? That's how you do it. Look out, I'm a MacGyver over here! job done by breaking orders how many times do I have to explain to you this isn't the military Reggie it's police work sometimes you have to make hard what what the hell was that it looks like a blackout
Don't forget to examine your... And it's back. All's well that ends well. I guess. Anyway, I hope you were paying attention from up there. To you, breaking regulations? To me, adjusting the operation's parameters based on changes in the field. Permission to speak freely, Detective Bennett? Not the military. What I saw was unnecessary, irresponsible, and hasty. We could have redeployed tomorrow with a better vantage on the alley. Reggie, these guys could have moved on by tomorrow. Sometimes you have to call an audible. Besides, I got what we needed. All's well that ends well. That kind of ends justify the means philosophy. Never cut it in the military. Welcome to the police force, Detective. Bennett, do you copy? This is Bennett. You notice that citywide blackout we just had? Looks like it's all lit up again now. Yeah, and so are the phones. We've got little mini emergencies all over Aventine. Calling in all available officers to help out. What can we do? There's a subway car stuck near Humphrey Street Station. And we're getting reports of a fire over at Juno. So send the FD. They're deployed all over the city right now. We're trying to direct them where it's needed most. Could one of you check out Juno and the other help out on Humphrey Street? Radio back if additional emergency services are required. A sure thing. Thanks. Reg, you get the subway. I'll check out the fire at the lab. Yes, sir. I see. Well... I think that's a I think that's a pretty good sneak peek. Uh, I'll see you guys next time, and I hope you enjoyed the video, so you can help decide if you actually want the game or not. It's only two to, two bucks fifty on Steam. Hope you can choose. Thank you, and I will see you next time.